I found a larger photograph of Christ Church the moment that the earthquake struck in New Zealand. This photograph, I've enlarged it. I've got a pink filter on it right now with a lot of contrast and a lot of saturation. And then on top of that, I applied a negative filter from my camera because when I did the pink filter, I did see a huge hole in the cloud right above the earthquake as it was happening. In my previous video, I stated that, you know, there was turbulence in the air and that possibly harp or some type of earthquake weapon was used to cause the earthquake. And this right here pretty much proves that there was something used against Christ Church. But there's another strange twist to it. I don't know if you can see. There is a hole in the cloud above Christ Church, but peering out of that hole is a gigantic face, and the face is looking down. It is so strange. This is a negative filter. And this is going down. There's the city of, um, the town of Christ Church. And you can see the dust rising up as the earthquake was hitting. And directly above that, there's a huge hole in the cloud with a face looking down up on the town of Christ Church. There are a lot of faces in these clouds. The clouds are turbulent. I hope you can see the face. There's a huge face looking down in the hole. And then beside it, there is something on the left with horns right behind it, also looking down. This is a close-up of the thing with the horns right beside the gigantic face. This is also in the sky to the left of the hole with a gigantic face. And you can see what appear to be some type of creatures. Here they are from a distance, a whole big group of them. Here's some faces off to the right in the sky. Here's a close-up of the faces. And something that looks like cells. Here's something else coming through. There is so much in the sky it would take forever to show everything.